This weekend, our special is Leatherman's USA-made Sidekick Multi-Tool. Boasting 15 tools and a couple of nice extras, the Sidekick is a terrific value, so let's dive right in and see what's inside. Drawing inspiration from Leatherman's pioneering wave, the Sidekick's two blades are outside accessible, with some thumb holes making for a pretty easy one-handed opening action. Both blades are two and a half inches long, one is a basic drop point and the other is a wood saw. Each one is held in place with a sturdy liner lock, so you get a very secure user experience. When you open the tool, you reveal the requisite pair of pliers with wire cutter and wire stripper. The really cool thing about the Sidekick is that the pliers are spring-loaded, which makes them much easier to use. Historically, Leatherman tools haven't had this feature, leaving you to work the pliers in some awkward fashion, which makes this a much appreciated addition. The rest of the tools are accessible from the inside of the handles, and it's a pretty standard set of Leatherman features. On one side, you have flathead and Phillips screwdrivers. On the other side is a bottle-slash-can opener combo, a file-slash-ruler, and a small serrated knife. There are carry options aplenty here, with Leatherman making it really easy to carry the sidekick exactly how you want to. There's a pocket clip present for easy pocket carry, as well as a nylon pouch for belt carry. There's even a carabiner included, which you can clip to a ring inside the tool and hang from your belt loop or pack. Given Tim Leatherman's seeming obsession with high functionality, it won't come as a shock that even the carabiner manages to pack in a couple of tools of its own, namely a hex socket and bottle opener. All in all, the Sidekick is a really solid package that offers some excellent functionality at an affordable price. You can click the annotation or the link in the description to learn more about this tool, and don't forget to check back every week for our weekend special. Thanks for watching from the Knife Center, serving the web community since 1995.